Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. It's time to take a check of your evening update. Brought to you by uh, 45 North. Find them in the Sugarloaf Mountain Hotel tonight for some great apres as well as dinner or tomorrow morning for some great breakfast to fuel you up for your daily adventures out around in the main High Peaks region. Looking at our weather Sunday, we're looking at uh, summer temperatures 5 to 9 degrees, so it will cool down overnight tonight into tomorrow morning, and it will be a much different day than today uh, or similar to the end of the day where things have cooled down. Six to 20 at the base we'll see a northwest west wind around 15 to 30 miles an hour up towards the summit for the day on sunday and down here on the base should just barely be noticeable so just be aware of things firming up overnight uh, monday we'll see cloudy skies summer temperatures 20 to 24 with a light west west southwest breeze at the base 23 to 27 so fairly comfortable out there with a light west southwest breeze once again hardly noticeable down around the base though as we look into the new year we're looking at a uh, chance of some ice snow or rain for the day on Tuesday. We'll keep an eye on that, but as you can see right now it looks like temperatures will be above freezing, especially down here around the base, so looks like we should see some unfrozen precip around. Wednesday, things will clear right out. Those snowmakers will be back out there resurfacing things and moving on with a high of 12 degrees and a low of 0 degrees. As we head into uh, later midweek, we'll look at partly sunny skies with uh, temperatures moderating up into the teens. Sunday, December 30th, Bertrand Interiors brings you a trail report. 51 trails to ski and ride on. We're going to look at groomed terrain only first thing on Sunday morning. Uh, around 50 trails groomed though, so that is a Good uh, sign out there. 8 o'clock, Snubber will get you up to the base lodge. 8.30, Sawduster and Skidder will move you around the base area. And at 9 o'clock, the Muscalator, which is the conveyor lift, will get you up and down the Birch's Slope. 8.30, the Double Runner Trails will get going as well, get you, getting you a little higher on the hill. 8 o'clock, West Mountain for transport only. They will be making snow over there. Uh, Skyline and Super Quad get going at 8.30 as well. They get you to a variety of mid-mountain terrain. King Pine and Wiffle Tree service the east sides of the mountain. Wiffle Tree a bit more beginner and advanced terrain. King Pine, some great expert terrain over there, and those lifts get going at 8.30 on Sunday morning. Timberline gets going at 9, winds and weather permitting, and as always, number 3 T-Bar on demand if that is needed. Tonight, schedule grooming here we go candy side lower winter's way boardwalk the landing the birches in snowbrook all around the base area central mountain trails like timberline bridal chain tote road upper level bitter king's landing and hay burner as well as competition hill narrow gauge spillway sluice gondola line and lower wedge so those should all be in great shape first thing in the morning as well as over on the east side head over to hallback widowmaker ram down and then lower on the mountain you'll find two hall wiffle tree and rollway all with fresh corduroy on them over towards the west side check out scoot that's a great trail especially if you're heading down from Bullwinkles. That'll be all nice and smoothed out for you. They'll be making snow over towards Windrow and whatnot, so there could be some uh, blowover from that. You might find some fresh snow on it tomorrow morning. Lower narrow gauge, Windrow, and West Mountain. That's what the snowmakers will be focusing on overnight tonight into tomorrow morning. You get fat bike rentals available at the outdoor center, as well as rentals for snowshoeing and cross country skiing. Great cross country skiing down there. Snowshoe trails are available as well. The skating rink that should be getting frozen overnight, but you want to call first thing in the morning, or be sure to tune into the Mountain Report WSKI TV 17 online or at channel 17 and we'll keep you updated first thing tomorrow morning and let you know if it's open or not new year's eve fireworks 9 15 at the beach as well as a bunch of other activities happening for new year's eve so be sure to check that out should be a great time and tune in tonight it's our last watch and win of the 2018 season and we'll be qualifying people for the amalgam skis we'll be giving away that tule rack as well as a bunch of other great prizes so 237-6895 put it on speed dial and call when prompted from 7 7 30 to 9 a.m. this morning but that's all over with so you'll have to tune in tonight from 5 30 to 7 p.m. and we'll uh, give away some great stuff so tune in to win folks